Just kind of, you know, obviously I got a lot of experience from, uh, you know, playing on a different team and uh, the Final Four experience. So just kind of lead the team and kind of help and pass down a little bit what I know. And obviously that we all, all our fresh, freshmen are, uh, uh, are bigs too, the, well, the three freshmen are bigs. So me being able to show them, you know, kind of lead by example is something that I'm trying to do. How anxious are you just to play? Maybe you got to see you got to see that last year because of the transfer rule and just just now it's now it's time. Is it, the time is almost here to come in and start playing consistently. How does that feel? Um, I'm excited. No, I've been out for pretty much a year, obviously due, for, due to the transfer rule. So I'm pretty excited and looking forward to um, you know, contributing as best I can to help the team win. What's what's been the I guess the what have you learned the most in camp? What's the transition? Are you in a different mindset knowing you can actually play games this year than in the you know practices and stuff um, like that? I mean. I went into practice the same, you know, just trying to get better and trying to improve my skills and my, my abilities. And kind of just seeing that kind of helped me. I knew that I needed to sell and, and gain a little more experience and a little more um, skill and develop my game. So I feel like that helped me a lot, seeing that and kind of understanding Coach Wade's system. So this year I'm able to actually play and be able to make, help the team win the best I can. Just how different is this uh, roster? I mean, you had a lot of time with the team last year as well, but then you kind of talked about it before today. You know, just you look around and see all this talent in Nas and then and Conte, and then knowing you're going to get in that action, just right. what's it like to see the whole kind of overturn overall this roster? Well, it's nice that we've got a lot, you know, a lot of talent. You know, we're able to hurt, you know. Um, the talent, obviously, you know, cause a great job recruiting. You know, so it's just helped the team and kind of, you know, as she's been down for a long time in terms of you know, winning games and having. Uh, losing records, so the fact coaches came in and done such a good job, you know, it's going to help the team and help the community. Yeah, yeah. Have, you the, sorry, have you noticed a change with the way? It's his guys, it's his system, he's a year in now, he's a little more comfortable. Have you noticed a little change in him at all? Not really, no. he's been the same, you know, it's the same in terms of you know, what he expects of us and what he wants for, for out of his team. And I feel like you know, he's shown that, you know, I, like I said, I came here with him and, and pretty much because he was his first year last year. So I kind of just everything that he's done this year and last year. Uh, it's kind of you know, everything I've seen from his coaching abilities, and uh, I feel like he's a great coach and he's helped us a lot. What, what do you imagine? What do you envision your role of this team being? I guess kind of describe your game to us. Where do you think you excel and can contribute the most? Um, you know, I see myself more of a defensive big. You know, I run the floor, block shots, rebound, and do you know whatever it takes to win. Really, yeah. so you know, whatever it takes to win, and whatever way I can contribute to help the team win, that's just the best way I do. So, looking forward to doing that. You're 100. Yeah, I'm 100. Yes, sir. You so you you ready? I'm ready, yeah, ready to go. Yeah, I've been seeing now for her. But yeah, now so I'm ready to go get back in action and help the team. You did as Coach Wade talked about using the big man, uh, how he envisions it. I mean he kinda told us a little bit a couple about an hour ago. Has he talked to y'all about the length of this roster and how much you really think she's gonna be able to contribute to the team and help the team win? Yeah, I mean he's talked about that. He's talked about the length and the length of the roster and how much she really thinks y'all can really make you know, be an influence down on. Um definitely, you know, we got a lot a lot of pieces, um, a lot of versatile pieces like Nas is a versatile big that can do multiple things on the floor. And that man is an energy guy that rebounds, you know, at a high rate and runs the floor and you know, brings a little bit different to what Nas and Barris does to the team. So I feel like with all the different pieces we got, you know, we should be able to do you know, pre roll this year in terms of down low and helping out the team win the best we can. Are you excited to play with uh, three to four ball handlers that can give you some winning passes down there? Yeah, I'm excited. You know, it's always good being a big man that you're having a point guard that can, uh, you know, make plays and get you involved in the game. Because obviously, you know, you're the one that's handling the basketball, so you need point guards and guards that, that can make plays and help you win. Do you see a lot of similarities between this team and the uh, final four team that you're on? Uh, definitely, you know, we've got a lot of talent, and the Oregon team had a lot of talent too, so, you know, I feel like um, with the talent we have, you know, we're definitely able to make a deep run in the NCAA tournament. Um, but one thing we just gotta, you know, not get caught up in the hype, you know, because that's a lot of things that a lot of teams that are ranked, they usually get caught up in the hype. So that's one thing, you know, just gotta kind of prove ourselves and show that we can actually um, win games and be a, a, a team that can make a deep run in the NCAA tournament.